Hi everyone, welcome to Creative Living with Jen. Today I am going to be sharing with you my annual Bath and Body Works haul for the holidays. So all throughout November I am sharing with you gifting ideas, gift guides, and today I thought it would be fun to do some Bath and Body Works, share with you what I picked up for the holidays. I know so many people love Bath and Body Works and especially Bath and Body Works at the holidays. It's usually a very exciting time as well. I think Bath and Body Works makes a really nice gift to give and you can go as big or as small as you like. They have such a wide variety that will please everyone's budget. So let me share with you guys what I've picked up for holidays so far at Bath and Body Works. I am just going to start off strong with Bath and Body Works scent of the season for 2022 and it is the new Dream Bright. You guys, this is such a gorgeous scent. Now I did pick it up in the, this is the perfume spray. I've never tried one of these from Bath & Body Works before. This is so good. A, one spritz and you're good to go. Definitely don't need more than that. Um, I've just been wearing it, you know, kind of, I'll just kind of spray it here or on the wrist. So this one is, oh, let me try and remember off the top of my head. I think it's like some kind of sapphire berries, uh, vanilla and orchids. Don't quote me on that. I don't have the notes here in front of me and I don't see it on here, but packaging is beautiful. They did such a good job with that. It is, it screams holidays to me with this deep navy and then the holographic sparkle, like glitz and glam. Yes, please. That's what the holidays are about. This smells so beautiful. I love this scent. I don't think I would pick it up in everything. To me, this is a perfume scent. This is what I want a perfume to smell like. It is sophisticated. It is classy. It smells high end. It's a very good blend. Bath and Body Works nailed it. I, I just absolutely love it. One three wick candle for the holidays. I'm not going to overdo it, honestly. I find that I'm only burning a few. I did grab this one, which is Winter, my favorite Bath and Body Works scent. And I love the packaging on this one. It's so pretty. It's again, holographic. I feel like they've used that a lot this year, but check out this lid, you guys. It's embossed, uh, or not really embossed, but it protrudes the little stars on there. Can you see? Try and, oh. and it's um, not really a rose gold. I guess it's rose gold, but it's almost like a champagne gold. It's beautiful. This one, the notes are white woods, pine needles, sparkling clementine, and spiced clove. Bath and Body Works just, it, like Christmas just isn't complete for me without winter. I did just grab one lotion for now. I am really trying to behave and it's tough because there's a lot of great choices to be had this year. So I tried this one, Vanilla Mocha Martini. Yes, please. I would love to have one of those right now. <laughs> so yes, the body cream and this packaging. Can we just talk about this? It's almost like a, a chocolatey rose gold. And I love this. If you look carefully right around here, holographic all the way around. They really nailed it with the packaging this year. I think they've, they've added a lot of details that I haven't seen Bath and Body Works do in prior years. So this one, the notes are cozy cappuccino, Vanilla Orchid and White Tonka Bean. Here we go. We're going to try it out. Oh my goodness. Mmm. Okay, that's good. That's all we have to say. Amazing. If you like coffee. Oh my goodness. I love this. This is... Wow. So I did only get one body mist. Um, yeah, body mist. Fragrance mist as well. And the one I purchased was Starlit Night. Let's talk about this color. It is faceted packaging. Now here in Canada, we pay the same price for faceted as we do the rest. I know in the States you have to pay, I think it's a dollar more. Again, with the holographic all around. So this is like a really deep royal purple. And then it, it almost has a little bit of a navy blue hue to it. It is just gorgeous. So the notes on this one are Oh, of course, it's not going to tell me because it's a faceted package. They always do that. They don't put the notes on the faceted. But anyways, we'll give it a sniff here. Brand new. It's going to take a couple. Ooh, 
I'm gonna get some bare skin here, but that's smelling good. Mm, that's really, really, really pretty. I like that. Man, they're just knocking it out of the park with these scents this year. Okay, so this one is definitely fruity. A little bit floral. Oh my gosh, I just absolutely love this. This could also be a really great contender for a perfume scent. I'm serious, like a, a, a berry. Again, I just feel like this one is a very sophisticated, classy, high-end scent. I really, really like this, you guys. I have left here are soaps. I get a lot of soaps because I like to put them in all our bathrooms uh, for guests. And I also like to gift a lot of soaps around the holidays. So these I will wrap up and I will gift them to my parcel delivery people. I think it's a great little gift to just give and add into baskets, uh, you know, putting little thing for teachers. Everyone likes a nice bottle of foaming soap. Uh, everyone that I know anyways, you know, family members, friends, it just makes a great little hostess gift to bring over, you know, when you're dropping by friends for dinner or whatever. So these are the scents that I picked up this year. This one was new. This is a new scent and it was the White Barn Elder Flower Gin Fizz. Check out this coloring on here. Really nice, deep navy. Again, we've got that faceted packaging and no notes, but we'll have a little sniffy. Ooh, really pretty. That's actually quite fruity. I like that. That is good. Don't overlook this one, guys. Oh yes, of course I got winter. And the packaging. See what I'm talking about with this holographic? They really, really, really use that a lot this year. And winter, this one I think is spiced orange fir balsam and clove buds. Just like the, the candle I showed you there earlier, also winter. Now this one, Fresh Sparkling Snow, is a baby blue with that holographic. I love the snowflake pattern this year. See, because it's, to me, this is a very smart move for Bath & Body Works. It doesn't scream Christmas. These, this is why I got this collection, because this can go out all winter long. I'm not just limited, because you know, sometimes when you get like the Christmassy ones, you want to kind of get them used up, so when Christmas is over, you don't have gingerbreads and candy canes and all of that dancing around at your sink. <laughs> this is gonna be perfect for the cold winter months. So right into January, February, March, we still get snow here in Canada. I can continue using these. So the notes are melon, iced melon, holiday pear and falling snow. Wow, that white writing is hard to read on this blue. But let's see what it, this one smells like. Okay, that's really melony, not what I was expecting. Ooh, I'm not keen on that one, to be honest with you guys. This is not my favorite. Now, when I wash up, it might change, but this one might be gifting. I'm just, personally, I'm never a fan of melon, but it is so pretty, and I thought that would make a great gift to give if I didn't like it, so. Now we have a frost, oh my gosh, my favorite frosted coconut snowball. Now this one, unfortunately, they didn't have in the snowflake pattern. It was just this penguin, but still penguins don't scream Christmas to me. Uh, it's kind of wintry and holographic once again. Now this one is toasted coconut, whipped vanilla and sugar crystals. I wait for this set all year long. I love it. They didn't have it in anything else yet online. There was no spray or lotion. So I will definitely be picking more up because I, I live for this scent. It is so good all year long. Actually, it's not, it's really, really good. It's exactly what I remember, but it's not like super strong. So that's okay. Uh, okay, I also picked up these gingerbread bakery and this one is iced cinnamon rolls. So I wanna compare these two, similar in color. Uh, look at this, this is gorgeous. I love how it's transparent with the snowflakes. So again, even though this is like iced cinnamon rolls, with just the snowflakes, that's gonna be great for overwinter. This one I'll use first. So let's just compare here. We have 
gingerbread cookies, brown sugar icing, and cinnamon spice. So let us, I like the gold top though on this. Goodness, Bath and Body Works, I swear, they always nail it with the gingerbread scents. Phenomenal. Now this one is also not going to show me because it's similar to faceted, so they didn't put the notes on it. I just don't know what it would hurt to put the little notes on there. Like, I really don't get it. My pet peeve with Bath and Body Works. Okay, this one's really, really, really good too. But out of the two of them, this is my favorite. So, both get a thumbs up. Just definitely a standout. Coconut Mint Drop. Look at this beautiful color. I just am loving the snowflake packaging. And this clear, wow. So, again, this one doesn't have notes because it's that packaging. But I believe it's like coconut and mint. Hence the name. Ooh, really good. I remember this from years prior. Now that I'm smelling it. Oh my gosh, that is so good. Yum. I think that's like the only minty thing I got this year. Vanilla Icicles. I believe this was a new fragrance or a new scent. Beautiful. I love this neutral color. Okay, so we have Whipped Vanilla, Amber Woods, and Iced Jasmine. I feel like this is going to be a winner. I think it's going to be really, really pretty. Oh my gosh. This actually has some depth to it. This kind of has a little bit of a smoky edge to it. Kind of smells like that winter candle. But I can smell the more sweet. Maybe a little bit, I guess with that whipped marshmallow, it's giving me some fireside, um, marshmallow fireside vibes. Oh my gosh, that is so good. Okay, I think this is one of my favorites so far. I, I would love it if they would put this into body care. I wonder if they will or if they have, I haven't checked for a few days. And new stuff is just constantly coming out right now. Blackberry Bergamot. So I believe this was also a new scent this year. Oh my goodness, look at the way this packaging, I mean, I have to hand it to Bath & Body Works. With their packaging this year for 2022, I feel like this is some of the nicest we've ever seen. I am loving the snowflakes. I wish they would do this every year, like offer a snowflake line. For people who don't necessarily want Christmas stuff and just want something they could use all season long, like I said, through winter. Black, dark blackberries, snowy cedarwood, and creamy vetiver. I feel like this is going to be a pretty, oh my gosh, you might not be getting into this one, guys. I feel like this is going to be a pretty deep, <laughs> I, this is probably going to end bad. It's going to either explode all over me. Oh my God. I got it. Whew. Work those muscles, girl. That one was tight. Okay. Ooh, okay. So that is definitely more fruity than anything. I like this. Really, really nice. Fruity and refreshing. Not necessarily what I was expecting, but that is good. I love that. Now, I also picked this one up, Winter Berry Ice. <laughs> It, just the cardinal on here was so cute. Or is that a blue jay? That actually might be a blue jay. Either way, I love birds. Holographic again. It's cherry, juicy orange, and snowy lime. It was the lime that got me. I just, I've got to, I've got to sniff this. I'm not the biggest fan of cherry, but oh my goodness, and it is very cherry. <laughs> it just winterberry ice. That one smells to me a lot like um. Cherry Merlot, I think is the name. It's a typical cherry. It's not bad. Uh, Snowberry Snowflakes. I think this one was new also, and it really intrigued me. Oh, beautiful pink holographic. So we have Juicy Strawberry Whipped Cream and Iced Bergamot. Yes, please. I feel like this is going to be such a good one. That's pretty good. That's really nice. I like this. This is a really, really nice. I feel like it's a bit of a softer take on some of the stuff that Bath & Body Works has done with strawberry. Strawberry, it's sweet. It's not really cakey. That's just really, really nice. One other thing that I did get that I've already put away 
uh, was not really Christmas related, so I set it aside, was the Vanilla and Lavender Aromatherapy. So the one that is body wash and foam bath all in one. I love that. And it was on sale. This was These were all sales too. I didn't pay full price for anything. They had the soap sale. They had the candles were on sale. I think it was $16.95 Canadian. And then the uh, body mists and all of that were $5.50. They were on for, or was it $5.95? I always buy on sale. And then it, I lucked out that it was spend 50 free shipping. So you bet this girl was taking advantage of all those sales. So we are gonna wrap it up there. That's my holiday Bath & Body Works haul for Christmas 2022. I mean, I am just so impressed. Everything smells amazing. Everything is stunning. Just beautiful packaging. They have really, really knocked it out of the park. This is probably the prettiest, prettiest Christmas I have seen at Bath & Body Works and the scents are just gorgeous. I think they just keep getting better and better. Thanks so much for watching and hanging out with me. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Please comment. Let me know what is your favorite item so far from Bath & Body Works. What's on your holiday wish list? Please subscribe if you are new and you haven't yet. I would love for you to join all the fun we have here. I'm sending out good vibes to you all. Can you feel them? And I'll catch you in my next video. Bye friends.